Um, it was by accident trying to find a craft project to do, and we ran across something called Plarn. So I didn't know what Plarn was. I went on to YouTube and found out what, what Plarn was. It means plastic yarn. And then I went to um, one of the websites there, and there were a bunch of ladies creating, cutting up plastic bags, making loops, and rolling them into plarn balls, which they call plarn yarn. And I thought it was pretty neat. And I found out that what they do is they make mats for the homeless by recycling the plastic bags that aren't um, uh, uh, is biodegradable in the landfills. Well, my husband and I have always helped with the homeless, but I have never seen anything like this, and I thought it was pretty neat. And I really was <laughs> experimenting to see if it was going to work and, and if it said that, um, if it did what they said it was going to do. So I wanted to make one, and I thought when I saw the ladies making them on YouTube that that would be a good way to give back to, to the community for the people who are met with homelessness. Okay, the bag is, the dimensions are 36 wide, 72 inches long, and it takes three to 500 bags to make one mat. Wow, okay, where'd you get all the bags from? Employees, uh, donations, mostly employees. Um, I send out an email in, in records division where I work, and then uh, my sergeant supervisor, he sent out a, a massive email to people and they started bringing bags in by the drones, and I've got so many bags now. It took me about two months because of my work schedule. On an average basis, on someone who has more time, it would take about four to five hours to complete one, as long as everything was cut and prepped um, prior to. How does it feel to, to have done something like this? I'm amazed. Y'all ain't gonna make me cry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm, I'm just, um, wow. Mm. I'm happy that I could do it. I'm excited about giving it away and starting a new one, but it, it makes me feel good. Cause I didn't, um, yeah, I'm happy about it. <laughs>